All right, Jonathan, tell me what we're working with. It looks like a lot, but I want to know, where do, you, where do you start when you first get into the dugout? All right, so first I start with the shin guards. Okay. You always want to buckle on the outside of your leg. So this is the left shin guard. Pull the strap over your foot so okay. it doesn't come off. And you just clip up. There's a, that's a lot of straps, okay. Sometimes, like if you make the last out of the inning, yeah. then you have to rush on the field a little bit because the umpire gets... He's waiting on you. Yep. Okay. Then you got chest protector. That's all that protects people? Yep. Wow. That's it. A little memory foam pad. Not even. Then you got two sets of uh, helmets. You have the uh, traditional mask, which is the helmet and the face mask, and then you got the hockey mask. Okay, let's explain these a little bit, because this yeah. one looks like, the, the, we were talking about Sandlot earlier, this is the one that guy was wearing, Yep. right? So yep. this is old school. Yeah, old school. All right, so, so that's the one you wear. Yep. All right, why? Uh, it's lighter. Okay. Um, I personally think it looks better, honestly. Uh, okay, so, so it is a little bit about looks. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, it doesn't, you know, protect your ears as much, but um, if you're blocking the ball right, you shouldn't be hitting, yeah. getting hit in the ears. So you put this on backwards. Uh, okay. Then you... Pull the strap back. All right. All right. Simple as that. All right. So, I don't know about you, but I am very competitive. I hate to lose. And I've never put this on before, but I'd be willing to challenge you to see how fast you can put this on. So, I'm going to time you, and then you're going to time me, and we're going to see who, who wins here. All right. Okay? You've never timed yourself. Never. Good. Here's your opportunity. Are you ready? Yep. Thirty-three. Uh, okay, that was pretty close. Okay, so you're telling me if I beat thirty-three, I've never done this before, then I beat you. Okay, here we go. All right, you ready? I think Three, so. two, one. Okay, no, I'm pulling on this. Probably gonna mess up your hair. Yeah, well, that's all right. Oh wait, this is a glove. Time. That's it. so embarrassing. That's terrible. 110. One minute, 10 seconds. All right, that was embarrassing. I can do better. But now that you, we talked about it, now you showed me how to put the gear on, now you got to show me some drills. All right, we don't have all day, but if I want to become the next Johnny Bench, what's the first drill I got to master? Uh, we got to teach you how to squat. So first, you got to give a sign to the pitcher. Okay. So what you do is, just like that, put the glove at the end of your knee. Okay. So the third baseman. Third base coach couldn't see it. Oh, uh, we're covering. Right. Okay, yep. got it. So we're going to give the sign of pitcher one for fastball. Okay. All right, two for curveball, three for slider, wiggle the fingers, change up. It's like the generic pitch calling. He can see all that? Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. You stand like, the, or sit like this all game? Yeah, so this is called the primary stance. You okay. give the sign, okay. and then once you get done giving the sign, you widen out a little bit, and <laughs> you give what? the pitcher the target. <laughs> what do I do? Give the pitcher the target. Okay. Oh, so this is where he wants to hit it. Yep. Okay. Right there. All right, we got the stance down. What's next? My favorite part is throwing out runners. So oh, that's right. I'm just gonna show you how to do that. All right, so Garrett Price is on the mound. Okay, Garrett. We're in the primary stance. Mm -hmm. We give him fastball. Check the runner. Mm -hmm. Set up. Mm -hmm. I have a ball for this. Okay. Set up, catch the ball, and then get ready to throw. That's all it is. You see the guy go, you throw him out. Oh, we're just taking one step. Just one step. Unless, Just one. Unless you want to take more. Well, we might have to, but that's what really what you do is one step? Yep. Wow, okay. All right. You ready? Yep. How much money will you give me, though? $50. If I actually hit you right in the mitt? 50 bucks. 50 bucks? 50 bucks. Oh, that that, okay, that was a pop fly, that was bad. Hold on, let me get my back into it this time. Hey, you might have got him if he was a snail. Are you sure you took one step? It's the position that you just can't stay sick. Okay, here we go. <laughs> you know, I think that's a lot farther than people think. That's a lot farther than I thought it was, that's for sure. Obviously, the throw has got to get better, but one thing I know I bet I can do is the pop fly. If I can't do that, I'm hopeless. So, what, maybe we should have started there. The ball goes up, you yeah. turn and find it, take off the mask, and you throw it once you know you're gonna catch it. All right, you ready? Yep. All right, here we go. Okay, we can see it. Oh, get Holy crap, that was so bad. <laughs> okay, this looks a lot harder than I think people think. Let me see you try it first, and then I'm gonna try. Spot it. 
Throw it. Catch it. There you, go. you ready? So we're going to spot it. Spot it. Throw it. Catch it. Okay, ready. All right, ready. Spot it. Oh, okay. That's a bad Sorry. throw. Sorry. <laughs> was that a good throw? It was. All right, spot it. Got it. Throw it. Nice job. Was that good? Yep. Was that good? Okay, wait. Johnny Bench, how close am I to him? Close. Close. A one out of ten. Are we floating above a five? Yeah. Okay. Not above, not below though. Almost. All right. All I Almost gotta say there. is, this position is a lot harder than I thought. Yeah. I'm gonna leave it to you. I'll stick with the mic. <laughs> All right. All sounds right. good. Thanks, Jonathan.